I'm here in downtown Los Angeles at The Row here, and we're checking out Pizzeria Bianco. It's a really popular spot, Pizzeria here in Los Angeles. Chris Bianco, self-taught, came from Arizona, a very famous spot in Phoenix. Started a location about a year ago. Very difficult to get reservations, but I want to see how great it is and if it keeps comparing us up to uh, Pizzeria Se and all the great pizzerias we have here in Los Angeles. So let's check it out. Small plates, got salads, and the pizza, of course. Go with the Little Gem Sour, twelve dollars. Organic radish, and the pizzas. There's like six different pizzas, but we're gonna go with the Sunny Boy. Tomato sauce, fresh mozzarella, and sprozetta and galetta. All of those. I, I, I totally mashed that. Sorry. But anyhow, that is gonna be twenty-four dollars. So look at thirty-six dollars. And I like the vibe. Good music in here, and just I like this area, downtown Rail. I never come out here to be honest with you. It's so far from where I live. I don't really go uh, east of, uh, of downtown. I'm really in downtown, unless it's a good restaurant. So hopefully uh, it's good. I know this place is really popular in um, Arizona, in Phoenix, and it's popular in K -Town, um, here in uh, DTLA. And uh, very difficult to get a reservation, but blessed to have one. So let's try it out. This video is sponsored by Junk Agency, financial services firm, life insurance, financial planning, wealth management, estate planning. We focus on minimization of taxation, risk, as well as fees. So if you want to learn more, click the link in the bio or go to jungagency.com. Let's try with the salad. It looks delicious. This is ingredients, aesthetically pleasing presentation. Man, I like that. That Parmesan is so fresh. Man, this is all about fresh ingredients. Can't wait for the pizza. Super oily, as you can see here. The crust is burnt, but looks good. Okay, very oily. Pepperoni is very interesting, really spicy. Let's try the crust. One bite, everyone knows the rolls. It's a spicier pizza. One bite, everyone knows the roll. I would say like eight, 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 three, eight, three. Very good. Put the olive here, too. Oh wow, I like the olive. It like fell off when I ate it, but the olive with the pizza, pretty legit. I like how they put it together. They put some sauce on top. I'm not sure what that sauce is, they drizzled it in, but I mean, it's olive oil, I think. But it goes good with that, with that olive. The spiciness. If you like the spicy pizza, this is the um, home. Sunny boy. Sunny boy. So yeah, if you like a little spicier, some cheese and pepperoni, then you'll like this. But yeah, I like it. All right. So what are my thoughts on this place, Pizzeria Bianco? Um, I like the vibe. Downtown LA Row. I've never come to the Row to be honest with you, but the fact that it's here, so service is really good, very attentive. We got this reservation on, I think, open table. But it's really difficult on weekends because this area is popular on the weekends. A lot of warehouses over here. I'll be probably making a video on downtown LA Rail because no one really comes out here, but Tesla supercharges at her if you have a Tesla. Um, they got one oven back there. Seems like they're doing a good job and cranking out pizzas. And it's a, real, it's a pretty big spot. They have outdoor seating, indoor seating as well. And let's go with the food. We ordered the salad, which was the, uh, I forgot the name of the salad. It was the uh, Little Gem. I believe it was $12. Oh, sixteen dollars with the cheese, and this cheese was delicious. It kind of made it really, really good. The cheese made it delicious. Um, it was a uh, parmesan and uh, very solid salad. If you want something good ingredients, it looked aesthetically pleasing. 
literally liked it a lot. And then the pizza, um, we went with the Sunny Boy. Sunny Boy. I think that was uh, 26, 26 dollars, I believe. It has olives on the pizza, actually, a little different, and really spicy pepperoni. But I would start with the crust. The crust was perfectly made. This crust is probably one of the best crusts I've ever had. Crunchy and just, and the pizza a little bit was a little on the floppy side. Um, a lot of ingredients. Pepperoni, I think, it made the dish. I, mean, I like spicy. Um, huh? Soposada, I'm sorry. It wasn't pepperoni, that's why it tastes different. Soposada, that's why. And um, cheese was delicious. Um, you know, decent size, typical size, nice pizzeria place. But I would probably say, yeah, this is a good spot to come check out. If you're out in the detail area, downtown Los Angeles, I don't come out that often. This is a restaurant that's worth coming out to. But I would say, yeah, pizza ranking, I would say one bite. Everyone knows the rules. I would say probably 8.3. Actually, no, I was 8.5. I changed that. Changed that. It's a, it's a good pizza, especially if you look on the spicy side. So, hey guys, do me, do me a huge favor, guys. Like this video, subscribe, share. If you're a foodie, if you're a techie, if you're into finance, I own my financial services firm, Jung Agency, you know, and uh, product reviews, stuff like that. If you like Tesla, I'm going to do a lot more Tesla uh, videos out coming out. My five year Model S review coming out soon. So, appreciate all your help, guys. Appreciate all your support. And uh, see you in the next one.